the uh, content on the screen at present has been uh, extracted from the Force 13's rolling coverage of the tropical cyclone over there in the Western South Indian Ocean. Uh, currently on the screen is the uh, current position uh, track chart from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre. This uh, tropical cyclone has a 17 nautical mile radius uh, eye and the centre reports that this uh, TC is expected to deepen further and the people of the uh, Mauritius region are very uh, concerned at this uh, system and here's a track chart from the Meteo France uh, weather office within the region. Now turning uh, to the local scene, this is another view of one of three WA live streaming cams on the swellnet.com website, severe weather warning for heavy rainfall remains in place for the lower and south west great southern districts Severe thunderstorm is currently in place over there in uh, parts of uh, WA. Damaging winds, heavy rainfall, large hailstones for the great southern central wheat belt districts. At 10:30 a.m., low pressure system lies off the coast to the southwest of Durian Bay, moving south off the coast to the west of Bunbury by. Tuesday evening. No pressure is expected to bring heavy rainfall, may lead to flash flooding. And this weather pattern, according to the Bureau, is unusual for this part of the year, especially for the Southwest WA. Now, here's a look at Invest 98S, which is no longer, however, the Bureau. Of meteorology still has it on its uh, books and later on this afternoon Western Australia time uh, the position will be updated by the uh, Bureau's uh, three-day tropical cyclone outlook. Here's the latest uh, precipitable water And by looking at uh, this uh, imagery, uh, there is uh, something that does uh, surface. Uh, we're going to see possibly uh, three tropical signals uh, coming on the radar from the east of Port Douglas on the tropical Queensland uh, far north coast across to Darwin. And here's a look at the CMC uh, precipitation and note the area in yellow. We could see a possible uh, tropical signal uh, developing on the weekend up in the northwest Gulf of Carpentaria region. Now we have a look at another model. This information is available on the Pivotal Weather website. This is total accumulated precipitation. And this particular model, which is the GFS, note the area in 
Stock Graham. And our position is that when viewing uh, weather-related uh, sites, outside official sources, uh, caution needs to be applied. The Himawari 8 satellite rainbow view of the western region. Now we have a look at the uh, deep layer or 24 hour wind shear for the eastern region and the low down there in the central Tasman uh, sea is to impact on New Zealand. Now we have a look at a live webcam I think it's uh, Brunswick Heads River. Severe weather warning remains in place for damaging winds for the northern rivers, mid-north coast, the Hunter Metropolitan Forecast Districts. And this is for dangerous surf condition. Apology for that darkness in the text. Uh, very heavy surf may lead to localised uh, damage, coastal erosion on parts of the New South Wales coast from Sydney to Byron Bay. Beach conditions in these areas could be dangerous and please stay away from the surf and surf exposed areas. The lifesavers have been extremely busy, especially over the Christmas New Year period. Locations are there on the screen, the Gulfs Harbour, Port Macquarie, Newcastle, Sydney, Byron Bay and other areas. There's the area in yellow under the warning. And we have a strong wind warning for Harvey Bay, Fraser Island Coast down to the New South Wales Queensland border, including Morton Bay. Now we have a look at the latest instability. And three nights ago, uh, I think I might have mentioned this in an earlier update, uh, I experienced cyclonic winds and I will uh, comment further on that, uh, possibly Sunday via a, um, a new uh, segment on the Force 13 main channel. And again, it's the uh, top end, broom right over to uh, Cape York. Now we look at the wind probabilities and each of these images are in three hourly periods and you can see what that deep low pressure system in the Tasman is uh, doing to the uh, east coast of Australia and the latest storm of probability uh, this is out to Lunchtime tomorrow. So at this point in time, possible threat remains for the entire area. Cairns across the top down to at least Port Hedland. Here's the latest Bureau's uh, total forecast of rain. Again, it's the area in blue, purple, pink to red. We will continue to bring updated uh, information
You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website Force13.com, which has had a revamp and is still under reconstruction, but take a look. Also, YouTube, of course, if you haven't subscribed, that might be a good idea. Visit Force 13. We're also on Facebook under the same name, of course, and you can like us on there, and you can also follow us on Twitter. Search Force 13 all in text for those. You can also add Force 13 on Skype or my personal account on Discord, Fool 13 at extension 9094. 